Hey folks, what's here again? Uh, welcome back to another Palm Acid video, and uh, we're gonna look at, um, well, check out, I guess, not 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 just look at Hilda. Oh, although we can also look at Hilda's new outfit, which I love. It's my favorite outfit of the bunch, personally. Um, but I, I generally like them. I like them all a lot, but yeah. The special costume Hilda and Mega Diancy over here, right? So, this is her EX, which looks very, uh, very rosy, very, very nice. Um, I might EX her. Uh, let's check out the kit. Again, I, I haven't checked, I haven't seen her kit yet, so... First reaction to, to her kit, I guess. Alright, rock type, weak versus steel. Okay, it make, makes sense. <laughs> steel being steely. Um, physical striker. Five star, obviously. Uh, as for her stats, um, almost 600 HP, 356 attack. This looks like, got, um, Buzzwell stats. Um... 150 defenses, 307 speed. So good speed, mediocre defenses, not that great defenses. HP's not that great either. Attack's okay. All right, let's check out the uh, moves. Stone Edge. I was hoping Dancy would be like a special rock type damage dealer because we don't have too many of those. I mean, we do have like blue, which is, you know, one of the biggest ones, I guess. Uh, but, you know, a lot of uh, rock type um, damage deals are, are, are physical. Right, there's just not that many like special rock moves, I guess, overall. Um, but yeah, Stone Edge over here, uh, X Attack, Diamond Storm. Uh, but yeah, and yeah, I guess, yeah, it's half Diamond Storm, right? So I guess it makes sense. Um, and Shine On raises speed and accuracy by two stat ranks, raises crit by three. That's really, really good, right? Um, plus two speed, plus two speed and accuracy. Max crit, plus four attack from here. Stone Edge Diamond Splash Diamond Storm, right? Hmm. That's good. That's good. Ah, oh, it's four gauge though. I was thinking of power and thought like, no way, it's that high with defense. No, no, it's four gauge. All right, four gauge AOE. Um, Mega Diancy sync move head start. Tough cookie, which is good, right? Swag bag. Oh, okay, 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 I like that, okay. All right, so like you could like totally just get like max tough cookie and like three diamond storms. That could totally happen. All right, that's really, really nice. I like that, I like that. Rock strike, universe strike, main character strike, passionate spirit strike, special costume strike. Is that like a new thing, special costume? Or, that's the, or is that? Do the seasonal ones have, like, special costume, or is it, like, something else? Anyways, let's check out uh, Mega Diancy first. Anyways, Mega Diancy. Let's see what we have. Uh, a lot more attack, right? And a lot more speed, which is good. The two, uh, the two better stats. <laughs> to be buffed. Uh, no move changes, it seems. So, basically the same moves. And... Fuel economy. Increases the amount of move gauge slots that uses. Oh yeah, I remember that. Uh, that's 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 cool. Um, all right. So t turns diamond storm into three gauge. That's nice. Tough cookie still swag bag. All right, all right, all right. I mean, yeah, it's a pretty good mega. I'd say pretty good mega. It's nothing crazy, but pretty good. Um, whoops, that's the everything. All right, let's check out the grid over here. Attack buff, not no major attack buffing nodes. Uh, there's one speed plus 10 here, I guess. Sync move power up nodes, four of them. Stone Edge crit strike one. Move gauge refresh three. Move gauge refresh three. Ramming speed on Diamond Storm. That's good. That's good. That's really, really good. Um, MP refresh on Shine On. Impervious Sand Shelter. Okay. Does that have any like sand stuff? Anyways, um, Fast Track 9. Fast Track 9?! Okay, adrenaline, double down five, extra 50% on sync, super effective. Sync regen, regen after you sync, towering force. Um, all right, that's Haybaker, but like for defense. Super sinker, super effective up. First time after you use a sync move. That's pretty good, that's pretty good, honestly. No, she looks, she looks nice. Even though, you know, being an AoE unit, but uh, for an AoE unit, her, her kill looks really, really good, right? 
Ramming speed on top tough cookie, right? Both of them relatively easy to get with fast track nine over here and her and her passives. Um Sandstorm probably, you know, or Sand Shelter probably just in case you want to run her with like another rock type damage dealer in, in Sandstorm, I guess. Something like a, you know, um uh Emmet, right? <laughs> Not Ingo, Emmet. And well I guess you could run the both. <laughs> Super sinker. Yeah, no. Good good kid, I'd say, right? Again, we, we we'd have to see where um the, the placements are. Right, in terms of the, the sync nodes. To see how expensive it's gonna cost to pick up most of these. But uh so far so good, I'd say. So far so good. Um good stuff. I I like her kit, I like her kit. It's pretty simple. It's pretty simple. But yeah. It, Quick and uh, you know, simplistic, um, and and you know the the the, the yeah the AOE thing you know it's AOE but it's a pretty powerful AOE for one, and also we could potentially be having you know uh, maybe modes that favor AOE a bit more right in the future maybe although I kind of doubt it just because AOE just. Single single target is so much better than AoE generally in Pokemon Masters just because just because of sync move right sync move countdown, but maybe you know in in the future modes that they're giving out maybe getting synced isn't like that big of a deal and then you could do like more total damage to the AoE then in that case that would be good right that that would be nice um, or if the new mode that they're talking about is kind of like legendary you know there's like no sides there's just one mid which in that case that'll be kind of slightly cringe um, but I, I guess that's like another possibility. <laughs> um, but yeah, overall, really, really nice stuff, right? Swag bag with a fifty percent is fantastic. With Diamond Storm, uh, you just need someone to buff two more physical attack over here, and then yeah, pretty um, pretty pretty solid. I mean, just I I'd say like if you're like bringing like a um. Buffer probably just someone that buffs like attack a bit and 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 and, and speed because like okay yeah like you could pick up the um, fast rack it's still gonna take a while to max that out actually it won't because you have plus two on your train with and it's gonna be like four turns you know what no 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 never mind yeah just something I could like buff attack like something like Scyther would be really really good right uh, Scyther could could buff you know max out your attack and then after maxing out your attack you could just like leer the opponent. To debuff their uh their their physical defenses so you're you know and Lear's AOE as well right so AOE defense debuff with an a oh no 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 yeah yeah D Diancy plus uh, Scyther is gonna be really really good I think uh so yeah uh good stuff good stuff folks um uh so after this we're gonna check out Jasmine which is the last one right so uh, anyways that's for me this one I guess hope you all enjoy it guys think in the comments down below uh like if you enjoyed this video support our channel for some more Poem Masters content. And I'll see you guys in the next one where we uh, check out Jasmine. And if you uh, guys haven't already, check out the other ones as well, right? Um, D uh, Diantha and, and Guzma, which is uh, Guzma's pretty funny. Go, ch go check them out. <laughs> Anyways, I'll see you guys uh, soon in the next one then.